The light shall bring victory. Ah, uh, bruh, kind of illegal. Calpy, thank you for the 26 months. Goodness, I'm trying so much Calpy here. Turn five in wild? Uh, I have, yeah. Do I have any good battle cries? Oh, I could do a uh, triple Ignis, dude. That's insane, dude. Mini -me. Chad, does it go triple? <laughs> once per game? Like, if it's triple but once per game, it's my once per game times three, right? That's obviously the way the card should work, right? Oh, this is awkward. I don't really want to go time winder yet. It does Do I go time winder? I can put a lot of stats on the board. So I could even do this double refresh and put the this. So I put on like how much damage so I have ten, so I have twenty. So I have to put on thirty, which I can't really do, right? Uh, 
Oh, wait, I haven't gone forge though. Oh, this sucks, dude. This really sucks, actually. Like, what do I even do here? Not much to do. If I can draw something that's forgeable, I also could use this with the uh, glowstone guy room, right? And do a lot of damage. Dude, how do I win this? I have no value, bro. Uh, I didn't hit any of my value cards. Didn't hit my. I hit one scale, but didn't hit either of my creations. Didn't hit any of my crimson clergies. So like, I'm just kind of breaking out here. How's it going? It's going well. Make a little bit shorter stream today. Not not that short, but like uh, I'm not gonna go to one. I got I got sex cult plans for the night. I'm looking forward to them. We suck. Round two. Do I want eight drops here or do I want armor? I think I want eight. Wait. Maybe I want armor because like I'm gonna have so much so many Ignises here that I want time, or do I want eight drops here? What do you guys think is better? Hmm. I'm gonna play this turn by the way. Ah, I'm gonna take eight drops. A specific deck, um, Warlock is probably the big one. It's useful against Demon Hunter as well. It's felt very useful. But, uh, it's, it, it's really for, like, the best thing it is for Warlock. Like, Justice, they give it the six months. Get on some training, so much Justice. Dead, dead. Guess I could have taken armor. Any changes deck? Still the same list. Still the same list.
Let's see if we read the vicious syndicate report from this week. What does VS say? Let's see if they had any interesting things. I know they said Demon Hunter OP. Uh, let's look at their uh, bombless warrior warrior. A bomb boss. Yeah, this is a. Uh, So it's uh, the. Anduin versus. Well, they put audio amplifier in there. No, never mind. Oh, they do. They're using uh, they're using my list uh, from Dono. All right. Um. Funnel cake. I think I'm gonna keep this because I have both of these. Let me see. Um, let's look at mage. Insane top deck. Leroy Paladin, uh, uh, Leroy is, I don't know, like a character from WoW. Uh, Dragon, there's a... Zamory? Wait, what's Zamory? Why do they call it Zamory Dragon Druid? Ooh, oh, there's a uh, cheaper dragon. You have a 12% chance of finding Xamory, uh, and you use that to win. Oh, that's brilliant. Okay, that's interesting. Do that ends it, dude. Water, sweet, beautiful water. Water, sweet, beautiful water. Oh, I came up.
Did I miss it? Wait. Quite Blick. Wait, I'm one off lethal. Okay, we got there. That was fast. So 100% win rate against Rogue and 100% win rate against Warrior so far. No, we lost lost that last game to Warrior finally. Uh, I don't like this playlist. We're gonna do something else. Let's go to the French music playlist. I like the French music playlist. Shall bring victory. One dose solves any problem. N64 game, uh, probably Super Smash, but probably actually maybe, so I really, but like that's everyone likes, but I really like Mario Party 2. I really like Mario Tennis. Um, I like Super, like Super Mario, everyone liked that one. I mean, not Super Mario, and Super Mario N64. I played a lot of that, but I think like, I played a ton of Mario Tennis and a ton of, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, I liked it. I liked Donkey Kong 64. Interesting enough, I played a lot more of Diddy Kong Racing. That was, uh, I really liked that. Candy, thank you for the 15 months. Got so drink so much candy. Let me see. Howdy for Texas. Is Deandra viable for a pet name? I don't know, dude. <laughs> oh, no. the, the, uh, I don't know what you're. <laughs> Beyond. <laughs> All right, thoughts. That toy was made just for me. I'm the perfect toy for you. My favorite was Goldeneye. Uh, I loved Goldeneye, and then my mom freaking took away Goldeneye from us. Uh, I consider most of my problems as an adult come from the, the the violence repression that my mom put me through by taking away Goldeneye because she thought it was a violent video game. God forbid! Dude, I'm still angry about that. Dude, tw like, chat, 25 years later. Still mad at my mom. You know, it's like, mom, like, this is, this is, like, when you're, if you're a mom, think about this. If you do something super Karen-ish, right? Your kids are going to remember that. 25 years later. I don't remember what food she made me. Hey, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember like, you know, which uh, so many things, but I remember that she took away Goldeneye from me. 
I had to forgive her. Yeah, I've forgiven but not forgotten, all right? <laughs> you know? She also took Diablo away from me. Took gave away my Pokemon cards? Dude, that's literally evil, dude. Like I like look, cuz, like let's say you get you get arrested, let's say you like rob a bank or something, alright? Um, what you do is in your trial, you say, look, I robbed a bank because my mom took away, robbed me of my Pokemon cards. Uh, and, um, on a certain emotional level, it just said to me that robbery is okay. And you get one, you get one Pokemon player on that jury and, uh, you get one Pokemon player on that jury and, uh, I guarantee you... <laughs> <laughs> you will um you will uh not be convicted, all right? <laughs> dude, Leo, they don't have red card, it's over, dude. Even Divine Shield Poisonous is not like the end of the world here. Did they get Rush? Did not get Rush. Versus Garrosh. Victory or death. The light shall bring victory. Why does two humans have two eyes in one year? Wait, we have two years, dude. Dude, are you Vincent Van Gogh? Come back from the life. I smell gold in their waters. Keep on panning. Kim. Bro, why are they going so out of their way to clear my boards? It's kind of bullshit. I mean, it's not going to work either, dude. Oh, it's Yarlow, dude. Yarlow's bronze three, and you were still playing against them. Because <laughs> he's uh, it's hilarious. Dude, I didn't recognize it was Yarlow because he was making his decisions quickly.
Chad, I'm just putting this song on repeat because I really like this song. And it's... Uh, <laughs> Chad, forgive me. But I just, I just like it. Sometimes I listen to a song 80 times until I don't like it anymore. But it's just, it's just such a good song, dude. It's... <laughs> Chat be the world champion? Or oh, yeah, the second place, sorry. Yeah. The second place almost world champion, Yarla? Yeah, that's my skill level, bruh. Oh, his opponent bronze. <laughs> oh, dude, it's dude, it's her stone's hard, dude. Wait, this could be useful on a trial by fire, right? But like, this is more fun if we pull it off. And this is like the deep value, but like, do we ever do tests here? But like, it's gonna be hard to play cards from other classes, right? It's hard to take tests as your first one. Um, Gunslinger is like the most fun one. Yeah, we're almost Highlander. We could actually abuse this with power. All right, let's take this. This is the most like suffering we could cause. We have to go Reno here, uh, but I have a, just a good temp like follow play. What if I add to her stone brew? Um, your this list isn't very good as her stone brew because we already have tons of value. Um, her stone brew is mo much be better than the aggro version. Uh, that's like a lot lower curve because your her stone brew is good on an empty hand, right? So. Wait, he's not playing Highlander, bro. I think I just go in here, dude. Do I want to play this? Once I play this, uh, maybe I do, but I just trade off this here preemptively. Wait, but if I trade it off, then I can't get this down, right? Because then it'd be a uh, six. So, oof. so maybe I hold so I can go Libra next turn, or just like Ignis. Actually, is like the better play. Okay, we drew Ignis. Do I have lethal with um? Did I just deny myself guaranteed lethal? I think I did, dude. Um. Got there, all. Well. 
Chat, another easy win against dude warrior is not even fair dude Dude, that's so true, so Dude, I do this guy who's good at math. Uh, he lost everything. Uh, now he's uh, <laughs> I don't know what's he's uh, he's not doing very well. The light shall bring victory. So I do this play with the uh, logic of um, they're gonna hit face, so I get a free minion here, um, but I take more damage to my that face. Was made just for me. But I really can't stick a minion there, so I like doing this better. <laughs> Great draw, actually. All right, no. McTheridon kind of ends it, though. <laughs> That's good for us. Okay. Can we just ruin this up? Son of a. Um, fellow Korea, wait. The fellow Korea Conversion 25 is sick of IT. Who's a carpenter by trade? Decided he wanted to be a dev in his mid 30s. Top contractor. Yeah, I feel like if you're if you're if you're goal oriented and hardworking and you're just like, um, you can you can switch in life, but it's like a lot of energy, right? So if it's like. So, like, switching careers, if you don't, like, find it energizing and interesting to, like, do the new thing you're doing, is going to be exhausting, right? I even know, like, me going from, like, insurance to entertainment, like, now a Twitch streamer, like, it was, like, uh, even, you know, Chad, go look at me during COVID, dude. When I was, like, competing and stuff. Dude, I didn't look good, dude. I, uh, it was taking a toll on my body, all right? 
Some say I was the ugly hands gamer, dude. People were really surprised, like, when they found out that I'm not terrible looking. After, like, I was terrible looking for so long. <laughs> You're talking the past tense, yeah, you jerk, alright. Just kidding. Greatest game on N64? I don't know. But I know some of my favorites. Um, I think I go for Leroy because Leroy is lethal. Um, Zillix is also lethal. Is this lethal? Oh, chat, one off hands gamer, dude. <laughs> one freaking off hands gamer here, dude. Alright, well. I guess I want to kill this. Ah, uh, son of a gun, dude. Power cord is lethal? Oh, you're right. I almost missed it, dude. Thank you. Almost this lethal has a gamer, dude. Thank you, Candy. Chat, dude. Pay to win, chat, dude. It's the... Be stress-free and happy. I don't, dude. I, I, I love this job, dude. But chat, like, loving this job, I think it's like loving your children. It's like you love them, but sometimes they're annoying, right? <laughs> Stonepa, thank you. Thank you for the gifts of. Give it the sub training so much, Stonepa. <laughs> You think we're annoying, dude? <laughs> dude, uh, yeah. dude. Answer: uh, Is her stone worth it? Like twenty times, uh, or is uh, something viable enough times? You'll start to go insane, all right? Chat is being a professional street juggler viable? I'm thinking about switching careers. Is it viable? <laughs> the legend tag is best. I mean, you know, what's annoying is like, it's all very easily accessible. Chat, if you don't know what to play, what you do is you every Thursday, which is today, you go to the Vicious Syndicate website here, all right? Why isn't it working, dude? There we go. Wait. Dude, why is the Tic Tac so big? All right. You go to the Vicious Syndicate website. What the heck, dude? All right. And uh, you, uh, you go here, all right? And you see, okay, I am not legend. So this is not what I want, all right? Uh, you're like, all right, I want to see what is the best for diamond one through four okay wow 
Shopper Demon Hunter has a 59% win rate. Token Hunter 55. That's a pretty big win rate. Man, wait, what happened to my face chat? Uh, there we go. Wow, Shopper Demon Hunter has a 59% win rate. It's the most, it's probably pretty viable. Okay, I will go play that deck. What what version do they want me to play? Anduin All right. Mech Shopper Demon Hunter, uh, Vicious. I'll choose any one of these. Let's see what they say. All right, let's take the Vicious Shopper Hunter. All right. All right, here's the list. I'm going to click the copy button. Man. Why is it so hard to find the best deck to legend? It's crazy, dude. And then I come, yeah, and they and then and and, and then. Uh, and then I'm like, yeah, it's the best. And they're like, but what about this deck? And I'm like, you can play that deck as well. You're just going to lose to Shopper Demon Hunter. <laughs> and people were like, uh, <laughs> why is her stone so complicated? <laughs> I don't understand, Mr. Street Man. Is it worth it to crowd out it? <laughs> Light sings and the echo. Mm, no wear and tear of any kind. Is it a safe to craft some Aria? It's it's more like people come to me because making decisions is chat. I'm I've so what I've understood about like being a consultant because there's a lot of consultants where I work live is that basically they do what I do where people can't make decisions so they hire the consultant to make really obvious decisions. That that's my impression of consulting. Tell me if I'm wrong, chat. Entire marketing profession, yeah. <laughs> consultant, dude. That's why I'd be a good consultant. But I would, I because I would just tell, like, like I would eventually realize, all right, people uh, are completely, com com completely unsure of themselves. So I'm here to tell them what to do. All right. Very obvious decisions, yeah. Bruh. I'm like so close here just to killing him. <laughs> it's actually so, like, here's what's annoying about this. is like I'm one off lethal. And if I could kill this off, I could just get Zimmery down, but they won't let me kill it off. Um, What's the line here, dude? Okay. Oh, 
Okay, do you know what I get like, you know like the, the meme of like... The meme of um... Uh, like... Wait... What's uh... Take advice was a hired a consultant to choose what my girlfriend wanted to eat for dinner. All right. Here's my impression lavish, you know, but maybe I, I haven't dated like your girlfriend, uh, just your mom. <laughs> Is that like, I feel like just people, they, your girlfriend wants you to make a decision and make a good decision, like and, and take responsibility for it. And if you're good at making decisions, she'll like you. And if you're bad at make you make crappy, like you bring her to crappy places that she's not happy with, she won't, right? Like, I don't think it's that common. Everyone acts like, oh, you can't, I don't know. There's like, I see these like memes on the internet of like, oh, you can't, you know, you know, guys asking their girlfriends what they want for dinner and not getting answers. And the guys are so frustrated. And it's like, you have to decide, right? You just decide what they're going to do for dinner. And if she doesn't like it, she breaks up with you. <laughs> All right. Is there a Mrs. No Hands? I've had, I mean, I've had a girlfriend in my life at some point. <laughs> I mean, that's the decision. She's got, probably going to break up with you if you do that, Saxlor, but maybe not. <laughs> These meatballs are bad. We need to see them. I mean, I feel like that's like, that's what... I was, I was so like I feel that's what like people want like they want they want you to make the decision and then and if you're good at making decisions they'll like you because it's like exhausting to make decisions you know if you're just like trying to do what she wants you have to say like this is what's good and if she doesn't like you she'll break up with you and find someone who chooses good places to go to dinner you know. <laughs> It's a lot on the line because if you choose a bad place to go to dinner, <laughs> you know, but it's like it's it's like a multi, you know, it's not just one time, you know. No, why did I keep showered rune there? I don't know if I want to. Is this why your girlfriend break up, broke up with you? Probably, dude. You have to do better, all right? <laughs> McDonald's wasn't McDonald's wasn't good enough. Wanted something else? That's what you say, like, <laughs> I guess this is what I got. This is what we got, <laughs> right? I don't know. Too late now. <laughs> I mean, uh, you know. You know, you messed up on that one. You'll try and get the next one, you know. A lot of weapon hate out there. Um, no, there's not a lot of weapon hate. Uh, there's freeze. There's there's freeze your face hate. Um, but then you you don't need that again. Like it's, bro. Ah, son of a gun. Hmm.
the perfect toy for you. But it's okay. It's a principle of like okay. So I hired editor for like my YouTube, right? Um and the more decisions he just makes on his own and makes good decisions, the more I'll like him. Like I I prefer when he just makes like decisions on my own and then sometimes I'm like, ah, this wasn't what I wanted. Like that's what like I don't want an editor that I have to micromanage all his decisions because that's going to be exhausting and take too much of my time, right? It's like the same idea with your girlfriend when she's like, she wants you to just know the best place to go to dinner. Um, you know? Does that make sense? <laughs> I didn't have my girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it, dude. <laughs> I don't know. No, I'm just saying, like, this is decisions in general, right? Well, I'm just saying, like, that's what that person wants. You know, like... You know, like, the, I mean, the... Yeah. Um, I was debating if I had drawn certain cards, so... I don't know. I'm not throwing away my shot. Wait, wait, oh, there's... There this? I did not expect this. I like this. Yeah, so... I mean, 100, I don't know, like 110%. It's just like, you just got to decide what you're eating. <laughs> like, it, it's not like that big a deal. I don't know. <laughs> Five advances. Yeah. We're talking this in the situation, you know, yeah. All right, I think I lost. I'm confused by the song. Hmm. It's not a contest. I was thinking of my girlfriend though. All right, never mind, chat. I think I'm dead here. Get <laughs> right up. You have best. Break up solves, that's a...
Add it up. I think one time I, I, I uh, <laughs> Chad, I can't get off this topic. I think I, I the, I would do sometimes I would give, uh, I would, uh, say, choose one of these three options to my, to my girlfriend. And then she would choose the option and like, all right, we're going there. So I like choke gave the, you know, I don't know if you guys know about like decision fatigue. You ever go to a restaurant and they have too many options and then you have no idea what to pick. Like that, that's why I kind of like going to restaurants where there's like five things made five things top on the menu, you know, like if I go to, if I go to like taco burrito King, I can choose between tacos and burritos. And then I can choose like, do I want steak or do I want like ground beef and I'll choose steak. Choose from these as far as Thing we come up with two options that that's a good idea brad stick yeah I, yeah coin flip tournament yeah you can also do things like where uh, you both come up with options and then you like, just like in Hearthstone, you like ban some of the options, you know? So you say, all right, we're not doing this. We're not doing that. <laughs> yeah, I, oh, I've heard that, Jazz. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Chat, yeah. Cheesecake back. I don't know. Anduin versus Anhilda. The stage is a battlefield. The light shall bring victory. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude. Her gas is super expensive. <laughs> that chair, man. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I, anyone who says alpha is like, it not ironically, I, I get weirded out by. What do I do here? Um, oh, let's just go double. This will be a four, three. Uh, it's awkward. Uh, I want to. Only true. Tienes the deck of brujas.
I could just play this on curve here. Um, just for like free tempo, right? Like, I don't need to go OTK against Warrior. Like, I can just draw Ignis at some point. I think that might be the best line. This is awkward. It's awkward because I don't want to. I don't want to overdraw here. I need my draws too badly, so I don't really want to go uh, the clay matriarch here. Uh, I've already drawn all my dragons though. I could use creation protocol here. Oh, this is bad. This is not that bad. It's very inefficient. They have the way they have to trade here, right? Supposed to play the mini first. I don't understand it. Um, this is a weird one. I don't really, I want to save Amanthul for uh, Power Cord because I kind of need the value right now. Oh, it's a joke, okay. All right, I'm making fun of this. Oh, yeah. I, I don't understand th this joke at all. I smell gold in their waters. Keep on panning. Kind. Relax. Let's warm you up. How much damage could I push with um I can go Leroy for twelve and then I can do double uh this is four four so I can do twelve uh 12 plus 8 no 12 12 plus 8 is 20 yeah i have exactly it's all nice why does it think i have 28 damage here dude it's broken thinks these have rush or something
Anduin versus Garrosh. Victory or death! The light shall bring victory. Ooh, chat, it's a notorious beamer Amon. Famous for his beaming ways. That was an error. Wow. <laughs> <Light seeds. laughs> the Chat, imagine if you just pulled that arm of duel, dude. That's such a crappy, dirty rat there. Like, that just looks like they're stifing, dude. But, like, why did they even dirty rat there? It's like such a questionable dirty rat. But it is the Tories VM Ramon, dude. You never know what he's up to. Dude, I like playing against the BMers, dude. Dude, everyone else complains about BM. The no hands gamer relish lives for it, right? I trade here so they don't have um easy other if I don't they go trade bladestorm. Let's warm you up. Keep on panning. Do you have this in a bigger size? What do I even do here, dude? It's awkward. Give me some dragons. All right, I think there's just, just a ton of value here. Get your own pan. Oh, wait, I'm rich. Oh. <laughs> I think I just overdraw here. All my other plays suck. Maybe I don't actually. I don't know, dude. Like all my plays are good plays are overdrawing. I can just do glowstone deal damage, but I think I just overdraw. I could uh, overdraw Zimari. It's real bad. I am here. Your curse. Ah, son of a gun, dude. Mm. 
It's an unfortunate overdraw, but we'll be okay. I'm pretty sure they're gonna Reno here, so I'm kind of basically like setting up to win against Reno. Can you explain mid range like you explained tempo play that day? Okay, so mid range. Um, doesn't really put a lot of pressure on uh, turns one through four as much as a, an aggro deck. Aggro deck is about one through four. Um, mid range puts does is a tempo deck. Uh, it looks to overwhelm their opponent with pressure, uh, but it, it pressures them in the later game. So it has more value dense cards. So just because a control deck gets to like ten mana doesn't mean they're going to win. Um, their plays might not be as efficient now. The, if the game goes super long, usually the control deck will win, right? But the mid-range deck, like, if I have, like, I can get, look how many freaking 10 mana weapons I can get in this deck, like, really easily. So if I get to play all my 10 mana weapons, I'm probably going to win, right? Just use more. If I can just get a uh, draw a Zimri here, we win, right? That is not a Zimri, though, unfortunate. Uh, I should probably kill this uh, this jerk one. I must consider one dose solves any problem. So my deck doesn't have like the defensive tools necessarily to like beat an aggro deck, but if you look at my like deck, what is it probably beating? Like it just has so much stuff that it's hard for a control deck to like efficiently remove it all. Um, so either it can outvalue it through like pressure. Uh, but it's about like maxim like putting the tempo pressure on to force out suboptimal plays or just winning with tempo but it's more of like turns five plus so it puts on its big attack into this so um like a tempo push might be like all right let's say i know my opponent's gonna start garris on nine right um i might push a lot of pressure five through eight and then like i know they're gonna go sargeras on nine uh, i might do like an ignis play get like a 10 mana weapon they go sargeras then i throw down a 10 mana weapon this is kind of how the, the mid-range push works, where it's like less about like just, oh, my opponent would have stopped me. Uh, sometimes it's like you, with your pressure, you force suboptimal plays um, that allows your other cards to get more values. There's a lot of that going on. It's unfortunate. Um, don't lose my other 10 mana weapon, please. Let's go. 
Let's drop one of these. What is the proper way to use funnel cake? You can use it as a better innervate. Um, you can use it with crimson clergies. You can use it to heal your minions. There's a lot of different functions uh, for funnel cake, uh, and you have to look at the individual game. Um, we don't go all in as on funnel cake stuff uh, as other decks, but yeah. Bruh, this sucks. Bruh. Well, Tyrion's good. I want to be elementals, right? Yeah, so. Wait, what is this shitty two drop? The six drop? Dude, am I ever going to draw my time winder, bro? It's ridiculous. Probably losing. Alright, does this set up a two turn if I go this? I don't think it does. If I go time winder, I don't think it does. So I'm gonna wait to get um Put your faith in the light. play this. Play this. I'm hoping to draw like funnel cake so I can get more mana and do more things in a turn. All right, no, I'm not getting renoed. That's huge, right? The song playing on repeat, yeah, dude. <laughs> Should I switch it? I, dude, it gets me in the zone, dude. Dude, I'm like, uh, I'm like the guy in, uh, what's the movie? The Keanu Reeves movie, dude. Bro. Uh, God. Let's see if I high roll this. Wait, I don't have any minions left in my deck, dude. This is useless to me. Bro. Dude, my uh, freaking deck is so bad here. Mm, I'm so dead, dude. I have no idea how to win here, chat. There's like no point in forging this. I don't know. Reno ends it. Oh wait, Reno, they have uh, TNTs in their deck, so Reno doesn't actually work as well as I thought. Probably should've just played this then. But yeah, I should definitely play this, because then I could have gotten a free 4-4 four four if they can't get through the taunt. Yes. 
I don't know how to win this game now. Chat, how do I win? Like, I know what they're gonna do. They're gonna, like, draw Reno next turn. It's, like, statistically almost 100% certain here. So, I don't know. We'll pass. If I can get a funnel cake out of my deck, dude. There we go. My chance to win here is, like, they go Reno and then... I somehow win in fatigue because like they can't kill off their own on uh, needle rock or something uh, but I'm, I have to beat a fizzle yeah it's a loss you're not going real here wait okay uh, that's game. Anduin versus Arana! Leave me alone! The light shall bring victory. Uh, which Keanu Reeves movie? Uh, dude, I like a lot of Keanu Reeves movies, dude. Dude, he's like an underrated actor. Yeah, I mean, people say he's bad at acting, but he's great at being bad at acting. Like, which means, you know, he's just like under, you know, he's like the character that like, he's like, you know, Cloud or like every video game protagonist where they're kind of like the strong, like the silent type that every like guy can kind of... Uh, put themselves into you know like he's just like he's just like uh he just seems like a normal nice guy until you kill his dog and then he goes and murders everybody that's like how every guy views themselves you know what i mean i've never thought about that before they're like exactly the same you know what i mean oh dude But yeah, so all right, Keanu Reeves movies, Matrix. I like this. I like Speed. I never saw Point Break. Um, I like all the Matrixies. 
I didn't uh, I didn't see John Wick 4, but obviously John Wick 1 through 3. Ooh, John Wick uh, 4 has a good rating. I need to go see it. Um, let's see. What other movies have I seen of him? Uh, one second. Got to figure out how I don't die here. It's looking bad. Not going to lie. Hmm. I don't know what to do here, dude. I'm probably gonna die. Let's, uh, let's do this. Just take the damage. All right. Well, if we can get a bunch of one drops played, we just need to draw like funnel cake here. Um. All right. So what was I gonna say? All right. There's a. Uh... I've I've watched something's gotta give. I forgot what happens except like. I don't know, like it's some romance and they're in some place. All right, um... Okay, it's speed, okay, let's go. All right, um... Wait, why am I missing, where am I missing movies, dude? Where's like, uh, Constantine? Yeah, I like Constantine, dude. Yeah, 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 I, I'm a big fan. Any movie that's like... That kind of stuff, I love that kind of stuff, you know? Uh, chat, I'm gonna die, dude. I wonder. Uh, I'm getting so wrecked here. You know what, I think it's right to just play one of these. But praise, I mean, John Wick dude, is one of like, so John Wick is a certain archetype. I call it, it's like a, the badass versus the world archetype. Um, like transporter movies are all like this. It's a certain art. It's a, it's a certain archetype. Uh, but it's, uh, I'm a big fan of it, but it's kind of like, not like, I'm not going to pretend it's like great. Like, great art, you know what I mean? Like, I just like, like, the premise. It's like, it's like a, it's like porn, like, the way, like, you know, but just for action, right? Like, I think they call it, like, gung fu. It's, it's just great. Like, it's just simple. Like, man's dog is killed, man gets revenge. Like, it's great, you know? It's, uh, it's not that complicated. It's not like it's not going to well it's kind of like a like what's it like horror or like certain forms of like romance you know they're 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 meant to be like trigger real base emotions you know this isn't like I'm trying to think of a movie that like really makes you think and feel Chad, what's a movie that like that's like really makes you think and feel and like that that is like old yeller. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Like old yeller, dude. But like, it's real sad, you know? You know, Inception. Oh, it's so good. Green, green Mile. Green Mile, dude. Uh, Gladiator. I mean, Gladiator is like good action too, but like an actual, like amazing storyline, right? Shrek might have liked But, but, uh. Yeah, there's a difference between that and like John Wick, right? So, you know, I'm not, but I still like John Wick's amazing, but it's like amazing at what it does, you know? Dude, I, I, dude, I like every Christopher Nolan movie. My favorite movie of all time, um, probably Star Wars, because like, like it was my childhood, but my favorite movie is like an adult is, uh, probably Inception. I've watched Inception like, I used to have Inception on my iPad, so every time I was flying, I would like uh, watch it. And I probably watched it like 40 times. Lord of the Rings for me. Any problem? 
problem. They need that two mana spell that gives them armor here to clear. Because they probably picked Sanitize here, but like now everything's at four health. So it's awkward. <laughs> nice dead you got there. <laughs> Would be a shame. Favorite anime? I mean, it's going to be Dragon Ball Z, right, dude? Like. But I'm trying to think of like, I watched a lot of it. Like I've watched a lot of like, I like Digimon back in the day. Digimon, I don't think holds up. I want, I, I tried to watch them like Zoids as an adult, even the uh, Zoids didn't hold up. A lot of the animes don't hold up for my children. I'm trying to think of like what animes, I mean, Totoro is a movie, but like I've watched that movie like, like a hundred times. Um, that holds up as an adult. Shall bring victory. Chad, I think I like had a day where like I remember like I was like um during COVID I like watched uh I watched a Totoro and I was just very like very emotional watching it, you know? It's uh it, it hits different as an adult than as a kid. It's like you like relate to different elements of it. Akame Gil? No, I have not. I watched the first three seasons of Hunter x Hunter because uh, Suzokula told me to watch it. But and it, uh, I liked it at first, and then I got bored with it. I've watched Castle in the Sky. I like that one too. All right, chat. I'm gonna we're gonna switch to like let's switch to salsa music. We don't have to listen to the same song over and over again. Or actually, should we listen to uh, go and do Infected Mushroom, or we should do Diablo Two music again? I like Diablo Two music. All right, here we go. Mm. We watched it a year ago. It's total trash. Yeah, I would wake up for Digimon in the morning really early because they would play it for the new episodes, and I was so psyched. Uh, it's 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 interesting what holds up as it like is it, actual like great art versus what's just like triggering your emotions as a kid. You know, like SpongeBob holds up, dude. Like I I watch SpongeBob as adult. It's amazing. Like that is SpongeBob is a work of art. Chat. That's what I'm trying to say. Um All trash now, yeah. Dude, I tried to watch Yu-Gi-Oh like the non-abridged version just to see like it was so bad, dude. Digimon Season 3 holds up? Interesting. But why isn't it playing? For some reason, my Spotify isn't working. Let's see if I try to play something else. All right, well, let's play StarCraft. Dude, it won't let me play the... All right, let's 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 go to... Let's see if we can go to... Uh... All right, well, let's chat. I'm just going to play... Um... Alright. 
Wait, dude, why isn't my dude my uh Alright, let's uh I'm gonna close out of uh it's maybe it's not let's restart Firefox. See if I can get it to work. There we go. I must consider. How did they get this out on turn six, chat? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> How did they get this out? Oh, with the coins, I see. That's not good. <laughs> Um, do I ever want to steal this for myself? So you're like kind of a good card, right? Consider. It's a lot of value. As you get older, yeah. Now that I hit armor, I'm just gonna go face. Especially because I want to do this next turn into this. Yeah, I mean, I, I like watching the Dragon Ball Z fight scenes. I just can't watch all the filler anymore. But like, the Dragon Ball Z fight scenes are just so, so good, dude. They hold up, like, you know, like like the first fight with like Dragon, uh, Goku and Vegeta did, so good, dude. But all like the like the the bullshit in between is like really annoying. You don't like the five episodes focus on Bulma, dude? No, dude. <laughs> The basic of 10,000, yeah. It did, I mean, it, it's, yeah, it's the probably one of the most influential probably shows of all time. Why did they do this? Ooh, they waited too long, dude. I regret playing this. I thought this was eight drops, which is why I played it.
Bruh. Vipers, uh, did it. I mean, not saving a 4 6 could cost me here. It'd be so nice to have it here. I could play it, get them free mana here. Oh, I'm losing this game, dude. I'm too behind. I never drew Zimmery, so I never got the free tempo turn here. How do I win this? Um, I could go for immediate Amontol. I think I need the tempo. Well, I guess I take this jerk bud, because they don't kill my Amontool, which is unlikely. Uh, we go Timewinder and Leroy, and we actually probably have it. You have best. Anduin versus Gerash. 
Now you're sailing on my seas. The light shall bring victory. I mean, Warrior, Warrior is necessary because it's the only deck that beats Demon Hunter, dude. Like, that's like, you, you, you nerf Demon Hunter to the ground, like where it's unplayable. Warrior might literally go from top tier to garbage because the reason why Warrior is crushing is because you have to only can play decks that can hit, like go toe to toe with Demon Hunter and it's favored against Demon Hunter. So... in a bigger size. Get your own man. Oh! Keep on panning. First I came for Odin. I <laughs> go away with this loud. <coughs> I mean, look at our win rate versus Warrior, 80%, all right? All we need to do is run some greed, and we're crushing it because we get a free turn. Highlander is better than the control version? There is no, what, Highlander is the control version. What are you, what are you saying? You mean the Odin version? The Odin version, uh, it is better than the Odin version, but they're both control decks. Bro, what do I do here, dude? This is like hella awkward, dude. I'm just gonna overdraw. Red shirt, thank you, dude. We didn't overdraw Zimmer right here. That could have been bad. I'm not really sure what I'm going for here. Son of a gun, dude. So we take the thrifties here. Don't fly away. We'll take a five mana weapon here, I think. 
I really just want to draw Zimmery. We draw Zimmery, and I think we have an easy win here. Because we we play we play uh Zimmery and we play all our guys and then we go like Leroy the next turn. I ain't fucking. That's good. Uh, need some dragons. Hyrule dragon? <laughs> Second Zimri? Alright, uh, this is, uh, insurance. I mean, these are kind of not very good here, right? Wait, I got a rotten dude? Wait. I get some free shit here, right? It's actually pretty good, right? I get some free one twos, so my Zimri's active next turn. That's actually kind of insane. Once for Kane, bro. Hey, dude, this is what I call dirty rat insurance, all right? The other options weren't very good. And now my Rodden brings back this jerkwad. Should bring back, give me some dragons back. I think we'll see. the impure fall. Water! Sweet, beautiful water! You have no place! By the light. I have too many minions.
by the light. Where's their move? Call VM didn't. That, like, they, they already used it all. Son of a gun, dude. Alright, I think we lost. Dude, we're not hitting the hands against Warrior. Like, it's our hands have been just super awkward. We're not drawing, like, enough dragons. Um, It's been rough. Ooh, I could high roll. I don't know what I can high roll here, but that's uh, gonna be a loss. By the light. <laughs> my torment is my is like creation protocol into like double glowstone still not ready to call it huh and so if i'm in this spot for 100 games i will win one of them like they'll have like 10 mana deal six immunity like they'll have the worst hand ever and i'll pull off a scam uh 99 i'm gonna lose but that one time where i get to ban a chatter uh is worth it all right <laughs> To be honest, so. where's the Diablo 2? Or the, right, I think I. Uh, uh, I can't win with that. I could have been like Power Cord here, and then maybe copied this or something, but. Don't you prefer the OTK version? Um, if I preferred it, I would play it, right? So, um, this version is greedier. Uh, the other version's more popular, more established. I, I've been playing this version for three days. I've been in top 100 with it for three days. I enjoy it. Uh, it feels good. Anduin versus Illithin. The Legion's rage pales before mine. The light shall bring victory. Some Brazil Samba? Dude, we could put on some Sail Jorge. Alright, let 
me. Let's actually let's go. Uh, Shale George. Let's uh let's go to go to Artist Radio. Let's try this out. Bro, the start kind of illegal. I mean, this card's an absurd amount of value for its like and stats. It just six mana is awkward, but like not only is it like a super annoying to deal with, um, but you don't have time to play both of them. Um, but I don't think I know the Sale Shores song. I wonder if it's new. Bruh. I want adjacent minions over Wind Fury. I feel like I do. Like that seems better than Wind Fury in this spot. Armor or four drops. Chad, what do you think it is? Uh, it's probably armor, right? Co draw two is actually not bad either. They're all uh, armor is sixteen life though against a demon hunter that's low on value. I think it's armor. Sixteen life against like a demon hunter that's low on stuff here seems too good to me. Well, like minions are get wrecked by Bacteridon, right? So I want to find the line that's best against Bacteridon. That toy was made just for me. Amiga de me and me here. I'm the perfect toy for you. Mysterious I know the song. Bruh, summoning ward here is brutal, dude. So actually so unlucky. I played around the hidden meaning though. Bruh. What did Marcel Strowman do? 
Uh, I mean, it's just a bot. There's no, like, they only spam one message. Well, give me thrifty here. Let's go, dude. Wait, crap. My rage is not found besides. Wait, I weapon. Wait, no, no. Uh, ruin one up. Yep. It would have been really great in this spot, right? Like, showered ruin and made that turn very easy. We just showered ruin and developed some stuff. Pocket Drain, thank you for the raid, Vulgar buddy. One second. We're about to ruin our opponent. Chat, welcome everybody. <laughs> Chat, we got a world champion raid, dude. That's exciting. Chat, welcome everybody. We are playing some Zamari Priest. Or, did I know it? Zimri Priest, Salami Priest. I keep winning with this good deck, dude. Isn't it good, dude? I don't know. Are you playing the more the curve, like the lower curve version? Or are you playing this build pocket? Um, I'll have two. I have two digits. I'll have you now. Do you play? Okay. Yeah, so there's the one. So our our build is like better against warriors. Uh doesn't run Magatha. But I kind of like this build. Who knows what the better build is? I Anduin versus Kerash. Victory or death. Yeah. 
the light shall bring victory. I'm gonna do something weird here. I've I've learned in these matchups, like I always want to be able to draw Zimmery. So I'm gonna do a weird keep here. There's nothing like this. The Remy. Pim, thank you for the prime. Uh, get on that sub training so much, Pim. Mm. What am I supposed to do here? I want to be able to go coin matriarch next turn and just I think just set up for. Uh, I feel like I'd rather. I need one more one drops to be honest. Um, so we'll do this. Seems the prime sum is owed. Thank you, dude. They're watching hours, dude. Dude, it's always weird, dude, because it's like the YouTube, the YouTube world's so different than the Twitch world, you know. And uh, you know, I thought about quitting YouTube like two years ago, and then like people like you come and say, "Hey, like your YouTube. You guys are the people that keep me making the YouTube stuff." So. Uh, GG Hobie, earlier, Hobie. Dumb song warrior, yeah. What would you be doing if you're not young Hearthstone influencer? I'd be like doing some sort of like work in Excel, dude. Uh, and like downloading databases. And then like I would have to go to a meeting and we'd have to talk about the culture, about like why did why I'm so passionate <laughs> about uh Excel formulas. You know what was like interesting? When I worked in Excel, like there were things I was passionate about, and it's like, okay, tell me if I'm crazy. I feel like it's like you have to pretend you're passionate about your job, but also if you're actually passionate about it, people get annoyed because you're not supposed to actually be passionate. It's like you're supposed to be like passionate in like a full shit way, but actually not passionate. Am I, am I speaking facts or am I making stuff up here, chat? Consider. My rage 
I'm gonna wait a turn before I pop off here. Uh, Crimson Clergy seems decent here because I get to draw the funnel cake here. If I hire another funnel cake, it could be good here, right? Well, like, I was, I was, uh, I was passionate about, like, I, I really like the efficiency part of my job. So I would take these, like, these, uh, processes and all my coworkers are boomers. Um, all my coworkers are boomers. So, like, they didn't know how to actually, like, improve the, the efficiency of, of like, a, a process. Like, that was, like, foreign to them. So, like, I would go and do that. Um, and they didn't really understand it. And I'm like, Hey, I just saved our team like, uh, 20 hours of work every month, you know? Um, and I really like that, but they didn't really care because then, because then I'm like, I'm really just taking away their job. <laughs> what do you think about it? You know? I want to be able to play Ignis next turn, so I think actually. Oh, here's what I do. Um, I. Wait, do I have lethals here with Leroy? If I go Leroy, I go to twenty-five, but then I go to. Uh... I go to 25, right? And then I gain seven. So seven uh, is three, it's uh, just barely off, son of a gun. Wait, could I go showered ruin on my own board? No, it's not gonna work, all right. Be gone, abomination. I think I'm just gonna go 10 mana Ignis weapon. Copy Zillix is good there, but like, uh, I'd rather get the Ignis down and set up for a big play in the next turn. I mean, double Zillix is plus six damage, so it's not lethal, so I'd like I'd rather get this down, right? Well, looking for a stand-up? It's a game to me differently in my head. Hold it in mind. Uh, Alright, I have the Sherwood Ruin though, so. Dude, it's kind of illegal though. Dude, uh. This is like the absolute worst thing we could run into. Feels bad, man. But yeah, oh yeah, so that, that's the thing we were talking about, like, it's like you have to pretend that you're passionate uh, and that you like this job, like, publicly, 
But to any of your actual co-workers, you know, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's weird. Yeah. Sounds like marriage. <laughs> Man, what way, dude? I think I'm dead, dude. Uh, D minor into like, uh, they hit the nuts here. Bro, my warrior win rate's bad today. By the light, by the light. I mean, I'm probably just getting vipered here. I think it's GG. All right, Sobian. If I win this game, we will be banned. I don't think you have to worry, though, but... Well, you, you're, you're talking to it also because you're like, you're fixing your, your, your team's problems, right? Alright chap, we got the double Amanthul scams here. I'm afraid of Viper, so I want to gain like 16 life here. Cause now I have triple Amanthul, maybe that's enough to win, you know what I mean? Like... Yeah, I mean I, I think like corporate desk jobs like aren't bad things, you know? Um, they're just not like for everyone or they're not for you your whole life. You know what I mean? Like maybe you do like 20 years in corporate and then you do some like five years of passion project, you know, like uh, maybe you like, you like do corporate till 55 and like you manage your money financially well. And then like somehow later you decide you don't want to retire. You want to start your own, like not whatever, like, you know what I mean? Like. But it's like a, there? bro. There. My opponent's hand is perfect, dude. Think <laughs> you're winning, bro. Uh. If I hit my other almond, I'm gonna give up. All right, we're giving up. Ah, uh, bro. They'll bring victory.
It's an NPF diagnosis. I typed in NPF and uh, it's giving me things in another language. The National Psoriasis Foundation. Oh, ADHD autism? Okay. I used to think I have ADHD. Uh, and I talked to my, my old girlfriend about it. And we included, like, I don't have ADHD. Because I just work all the time. But I also play video games for a living, so I don't know. Uh, I think I just... It seems like... I think a lot of people times it'll seem like you have ADHD because you just hate your job. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I'm having a hard time finishing up my taxes right now because it's so boring. And I imagine, like, imagine, like, uh, that'd be a really hard job to do for a living. ADHD doesn't mean lacking work ethic. Yeah, but I'm also able to focus for, like, a really long time. You know what I mean? I don't know. But I can't focus, like, when I try to do my taxes for a long time, I have a lot of trouble. I, I've been doing, like, an hour a day, and, like, a lot of times I don't make an hour. It's, like, it's just so miserable. <laughs> Hyperfocus is a part of ADHD. So then, like, why is it a bad thing? That's what I mean. Like, it sounds like it's an advantage. <laughs> you know? Like, I have hyperfocus. I can stay in flow state forever. And I just can't do boring shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> what you hyper focus on yeah so i don't know what you focus on yeah but that's also like in school uh uh, yeah, I don't know. They the my, they wanted to test me test me for ADHD as a kid, and I, I didn't want to get tested because it wasn't. But uh, cause, but. Yeah, I don't know. An advantage is just evolution. I like that take too. <laughs> I don't know. You <laughs> focus on X. Yeah. The dopamine of social media. Yeah, I, I mean, I uninstall. Uh, I'll, I'll find myself doing social media stuff too much. I'll uninstall. I don't know. But... Because it like, kind of makes me like... It's easy to keep going, but it makes me feel bad. I don't know. What a, didn't see that one coming. I don't know. I'm not sure. I I, I got prescri like, prescribed with Adderall from my doctor once. So I, I've, I've taken it and like, it's very powerful, but that makes sense. So I don't know. Big negative. Yeah. So that's what I mean is like, it's, uh, but even like amongst white collar jobs, like, I don't know. Colex, they give it the 23 months. Yeah, that's such a thing. So much Colex. I don't know. It's like, that's what it means. Like a lot of people aren't going to be able to just like focus on work that they find meaningless for a huge amounts of time. But even like I can, 
I think I can like play Hearthstone longer because of the social element of it. Because I'm a very like extroverted, like because I can stream long because it feels social. Um, if that makes sense, I can focus longer than if I was just playing by myself. Um, Yeah. That's really noticeable. Okay, interesting. Yeah, so that's why I don't think I have ADHD. Because I can focus really... But I get I get burnt out if I focus... Like, so if I do too much, like... Um, I can focus on things that are important to me. But certain things, like cleaning... Like, I get really burnt out by, like, cleaning my apartment. Um, uh, like, certain kinds of activities burn me out really fast. That... <laughs> So, I don't know, but... I have trouble, yeah. Five, for more than five minutes, yeah. Mr. Barney, thank you for the four months. Get on such things with Mr. Barney. What, what, what exactly do we do here? I think I want to just slam down Amanthol, dude. Like, if it sticks, it's amazing here. Like, they just, uh, committed here. Pretty hard, right? Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, Sonya's insane with, uh, the funnel kicks. I can get two funnel cakes, which is kind of sick, right? This is a weird one because I can get, um, I can get two of this, right? Uh, and I also think I'd rather just get Ignis down. It's a weird one. Um, be gone, abomination.
Overdrawing for no reason here. I meant to use a snake oil, but let's do it. Lethal, right? Okay, how much damage do I have here? This is 13, right? And I can do another five. So it doesn't look like lethal on its own. Wait, I could I could try and draw Leroy's here. Or I could do double glowworm. Double glowworm would be uh thirteen plus ten for one off, right? Leroy is not lethal as well, right? Okay. Wait, Leroy I have to quickly. let's do this. My torment is my ease. Sorrow cord. Take your time. Turn it guys, zero mana sleet skater. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, if I had um You looks like father so delightful, I don't know what that means. Wait, is it father from uh from uh what's the the show? Uh, Full Metal Alchemist? Is that what you're talking about, Godiva?
undoing versus Arana! Leave me alone! The light shall bring victory! So, interestingly, the stats kind of think I should keep this card, and I know why. Um, it's your answer to the 6-5, which is really, really good. Wait, they're playing Naga bullshit? One ma uh, one matriarch, yep. Just for me. I'm the perfect toy for you. Solves any problem. Mm, it's unfortunate. If I don't go Sherwood Ruin, Summoning Ward's a huge punish here. I guess I can go the Funnel Cake, right? And just see if I play around it. Dude, do perfect freaking hits there, dude. Brutal. Dude, they got freaking. Oh, God. Losing that, that counter spell is brutal there. If it's not counter spell. Like, if it's like Ice Barrier there, I go Shattered Ruin. I full clear. It's like we're massively ahead. Instead of we're in this situation. But hopefully, no. Uh, looks like no uh, Mechtheridon here. So when they don't hit Mechtheridon. It's very good for us. Stone to perfection. That toy was made just for me. Look sad today? Um, I don't know. Uh, I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm sad today.
I should see, I should play into rat trap here. Not rat trap. Not too quickly. Mini me. <coughs> Son of a gun, dude. I'm probably just supposed to not attack there. I'm the perfect toy for you. Freezing's too much of a punish. Mysterious orb. What is your wisdom? Yeah, so there's not enough payoff to attack there. I just was too many things. Bad play. There was an earthquake in New York City today. I heard that. Anyone die? Does that mean the apocalypse is coming? Jingus is Even viable right now. Uh, it, it, it's it's. <laughs> Chad, sometimes, <laughs> dude, I, I get to see the viable questions. Are we happy with the meta? I don't know. It's all right. You know, it's this. It's something to do. Uh, I'm sad that Warlock gets wrecked. Um. Do I go double clay matriarch here or do I do uh glowstone and kill the 3-3? Three, three? I think I kill the 3-3. Three, three. They have too many things in their hand here. I can't do I can't do that. I'm not throwing away my but. shot. If three rights make a land. <sighs> Is this really better than nothing?
Versus Anduin! I will protect my legacy. The light shall bring victory. Solves any problem. Hmm. Not too quickly. I feel like they don't trade this off. This is just rice cakes and peanut butter, dude. The no hand staple. It was Leroy the wing condition, dude. The wing condition is your opponent starting the operation. Binge baited.
have better. Nice dead you got there. Monkey monkey, thank you for the raid, dude. Dude, I haven't seen you in a while. Chat. Do you think, uh, chat, maybe I'm not the number one bait streamer. Well, if you, I, I might be the number one bait streamer, but the number one bait YouTuber. <laughs> Go check out Funky Monkey. Dude, he be playing decks. He be making meta breakers. He's going to waste your dust, but once in a while, he's going to break the game. All right. Go check him out. This guy is making decks every day. Hope you're doing well, dude. Lucky, lucky better breaker, dude. Dude, it's not luck, dude. Wait, son of a! Wait, I literally have. Did they pull up my almond tool? I went on the spot there, chat. This is this bullshit happened. I just went on the spot when they went almond tool there, or like my clay march shirt. What is this the most sleeper deck? Honestly, this deck, dude. This deck is one demon hunter nerf from like terrorizing the meta, dude. How's your stream going so far? It's going good. We're, we're just playing some priest, dude. Chat, Plague should discount the Rifty Drifters. Thoughts? I'm in trouble, chat. Bro. 
Frostblake is so... It's like ridiculously illegal here. Chad, do I ever just steal their Helio win condition? Probably not. I'm kind of dying here. One more death can't hurt. People stop caring about plague. Dude, I look at to be honest, like plague death, like something about hell yeah enrages you far more than like a tier one deck. It's that feeling of like inevitability dude this card is enraging but it, i do enjoy the suffering causing it, like like this is look at this this just enrages me chat i'm so freaking dead here uh i'm gonna go for a six mana um, uh this for lifesteal and hope to high roll something Ooh, mctheridon's insane actually Once they delete Hunter, <laughs> dude, it's like you can't just commit to Highlander decks because of plagues, you know. It's like this, um, and like the the average casual player loves Highlander decks. All right, there's nothing that makes a casual player happier than a ball of thirty cards with with a Highlander card, you know. Um, yeah, Blizzard keeps appealing to these uh, these giant pay-to-win players. <laughs> A highlighter mirror. All right. Uh, I think I'm dead here. You have best. Lots of viewers today, dude. They're pockets viewers and Funky's viewers. But we got a bunch of big hosts. Dude, I have sex cult though tonight. I can't. I would love to stay up with all the viewers today, but I got I got life to do. But yeah, dude, thanks everybody for uh, dude hanging out lately. The stream is the I've had the big, best viewership I've had since I've been streaming this month. Like, and it's not even close. So, really happy uh, to be doing this professionally and uh, having great numbers. So, thanks everyone for hanging out and supporting the stream uh, and being part of the World War Two jokes. Uh, and talking about nonsense. Anduin versus Jaina. For numbers, yeah. Fun time too, yeah. Yeah, I wonder if that means like Hearthstone's just doing well. Like, I mean, like, Hearthstone could, like, make a comeback. It happens to games all the time. Like, it might be growing, you know? Because, like, uh, Pocket, I've had so many expansions where numbers are good for two weeks, and then the first nerf row, and then, like, numbers crash. I've seen it happen so many times, but it hasn't happened this time. So... But I never know if it's a fun expansion because, like, one, I play this professionally. Um, and two, literally everyone is saying that uh, this meta is, like, dude, do the model, I've seen the comments, the very, like, this happens literally every meta. Um, but everybody is always be saying, like, this meta is the worst meta of all time. Like, I, it's, uh, like, people say that every single expansion. And I never know, like... Is it a bad meta? I don't even know. Like I've, I've, uh, uh, I think I'd rather power cord this. Zero mana Yog. Dude, I enjoyed Beast of Zero mana Yog though.
What if I was just supposed to go Crimson Power Cord last turn? I don't know. One dose solves a problem. Way too long. I mean, so what's interesting, Chad, I looked at the, 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 the stats at Diamond 4 through 1 in the BS report. Di Demon Hunter had a 59% win rate. Hunter had a 54% win rate. Like, it is so above the rest. Like, it really is a problem at the low ranks. And it's a problem with the high ranks, too. So it's, like, such an easy nerf category, like, candidate. Like, but it's, like, actually, <laughs> it's actually such a problem, to be honest. having fun yeah uh jotex all right I, I this is the unfortunate truth jotex um so the logic of my this is i've explained this and some people this but so on average half of players are unlucky and then amongst the unlucky players like if you look at your life to long luck if you compare yourself to other people um you you're going to be in a certain percentile of luckiness and guessing from what you're saying here, you're probably just in a low percentile of luckiness. So that means is like, you're just gonna get a lot more bad luck in life. And you're just gonna have to live with that. Uh, I don't know what you, to tell you, dude, um, but you're just unlucky. And you know, I would say don't go to Vegas. Uh, that's a bad idea. But you know, uh, I would say, you know, t uh, make sure to take a job that like, isn't too just like reliant on RNG. Uh, so, yeah. And you, like, sometimes you'll hear players say, people will say, like, no, no, you just need to get good. Um, they're just trying to, like, like, they're just trying to justify the fact that they're one of the lucky people. And they don't want, like, society to, like, come after them. Because really, like, Blizzard should identify you as one of the lucky people and give you like like an RNG bonus, but they don't want to do that because that would help like make it harder for them to make money. Does that make sense? Because people like you get unlucky and then they buy more runestones, so. <laughs> do I have a reason to take Odin? These all suck, not gonna lie. Um... I don't have any like armor cards in my deck, right? right these all suck. This is a rush minion. Uh, and stop Civ trust. All right, dude. Um, I can do 14, 16 burst. Okay. Uh, Reality wait. woven. Heroes that champion order. I'm gonna find songs I know. They kill my freaking dude. They always do. 
Son of a gun, dude. How do I deal with this bullshit? Ah, son of a gun, dude. I guess draw Zimmery here. Um. Oh, I'm so dead here, dude. I got. And these suck. Uh, I can't beat them. You have best. Yeah, Zimri would give me like the free turn that I could use it, but exactly, Doritos. <laughs> but yeah. So, so basically in life, you should figure, try and figure out how lucky you are. And then depending on that, um, so like, um, so you'll hear like a lot of people who make it in like Hollywood say, oh, I got very lucky. Right. But they might've figured out that they're one of the lucky people. So they kind of use skill to recognize that they were lucky and take the risk to go out to Hollywood and try and make it, right? So it's kind of a skill of recognizing that you're one of the lucky people in the world and then like leveraging that into success. Where if you're unlucky, you should take like a low risk job in general, um, you know, try, try to just minimize risk as much as possible. I, I mean, there are people who make it who didn't have, uh, you know, certainly easy if you have nice. Then why is not Ariana Grande in the Masters Tour with their RNG? Um, so Hearthstone's like a double-edged sword. You're lucky to win in it, but you're unlucky that your life is playing Hearthstone, right? <laughs> so it's kind of like, it's actually like if you're a professional Hearthstone player, that means you're like mid-luck, you know? But amongst Hearthstone players, like Hearthstone players in general are unlucky. Does that make sense? <laughs> Bro, I have like infinite value generation this turn. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it looks great. <laughs> so so to, to to take out this funny thing um i would like i gotta think of my turn here it's a tough turn actually we kind of value overload here um Consider. Light sings and the impure fall. She double, do I just take like the big greed play with like double clay matriarchs here? Um, it's a lot of greed. 
That might be right. I mean, double gift wealth is like a lot of dragony stats. I think I'll just take that. Glowstone, uh, it's six mana, so it's just like a lot of mana to dip the damage in. And I already have so much value. I have double power cord even, so like I can duplicate lots of, you know, uh, I can duplicate a lot of things here. If I overdraw Time Winder. You want to overdraw me? Or do you want to uh, stop the panning? Hand is too full. Okay, overdraw. The uh, classic aggro. This one has a lot more greed. It has Ignis. It has uh, scale. Uh, this so you're basically your matchup against Warrior is a lot better. But um, in really hyper tempo matchups, um, I also think the Glowstone Gray Worm to the Shadowy Rune Tech is good against Demon Hunter. So uh, I think this list is better against Demon Hunter and Warrior. But it's like worse in the mirror. I think it's like worse against Mage. Um, it's definitely worse in certain situations. I haven't quite figured out what situations it's better and worse than yet, but that's what I would say is, um... So this is like a big go dirty red here. Is dirty red even a good play here? <laughs> they don't have like shield slam here, they just lose, dude. They probably just threw here with this play, bro. Which is kind of hilarious. Everyone thinks that they beat this deck with Dirty Rat, like. All right, um. Um. Am I guaranteed to hit Thrifty Drifters? Uh, I'm so likely to hit either Thrifty or um, or Zilliax here, right? So I think I go for that. Must consider. And I bricked on both of them. Wow, it's so bad, dude. It's so freaking bad. All right, that's like so bad, dude. Uh, I had this win if I just hit one of those. 
Oh, uh, it's so bad. I guess we go crimsons. Because I can take them and then draw. There they are, but I'll do them in a future turn. Okay, chat. <laughs> okay, just pulled off a scam here, dude, because I have Helia now. So now I can just go... <laughs> I can just go double Helia and win, right? Like, um... Alright, so we go time winder, play some stuff, play the Helia, play a second Helia, win the game? What? Or do I just have two turn lethal? So I go time winder. Do I just have lethal here? Leroy is 26. And then, yeah, dude, I'm actually disappointed that I have lethal here. Because I wanted to just win with, um... With hell yeah, but... Lethal. Chad, that's how you like that's how you could tell what kind of person I am. That like I pull off like a scam and then win in the most efficient, boring way of like, you know. Chad, I'm that's why I like Dragon Ball Z. Like, cause every Dragon Ball Z, like the the character is winning, right? Then but they're bored, so they're like, actually I'll let you pull up uh pull let you power up to your full power. And then, like, and then, so, like, yeah, like, think about, like, the fight of Gohan versus Cell. Cell, like, could easily just kill everybody, but doesn't, right? And then, Cell powers up Gohan, and then Cell could, e Gohan could easily kill Cell, but doesn't. And then, uh, next thing you know, <laughs> yeah. Imagine if, like, Piccolo just, like, managed to kill Cell in, like, the first fight. That could have had, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Even though I don't, but, even though that didn't really, but... Alright, illegal top deck, dude. Kind of illegal.
exist in harmony. This desecration of the Titan's land stops here. Molded in my I can copy this jerk wad though and gain like infinite health here. It's kind of good, right? Top deck one drop is really good for us here. Uh, like I could get like three thrifty drifters down. I could just top deck a one drop here. Alright, so do I throw down all the thrifties here? Or do Amanthul? I think I throw down all the thrifties. Does seem better. Hello. Chat, the... Dude, I feel like uh, the priestess philosophy is like... Dude, priest is like that person in real life that goes through a million different identity crises. Like, priests went through their phase where they're like, you know what? I'm never... I'm not aggro anymore. I'm just control. Like, I'm, I do healing and I do disruption and I don't win the game. Um, and then the priest was like, screw that, I'm gonna win the game, you know? I don't win it's so accurate. This desecration of the Titan's land stops here. Just use more. 
Wait. Could you copy Libra with Amanthal? Yeah, it's, it's board space issues though. So like we have like if we had unlimited board space, we probably could have had lethal there, but we can't kill off our own minions and stuff. So. Is there? No. Ooh, I read put Helia just in time, dude. What are they? What are they playing that they run this card? GG Jakey Anduin versus Anhilda I'm always watching. The light shall bring victory. I can't do that. Bro, you're hiding behind the deck overlay, dude. You put the deck overlay there, dude. You gotta learn how to move it. Charity, <laughs> a tier five sub. That's true, dude. It's your fault for not uh, being able to afford that, though.
nice to meet you. My range is not found in size. Need help. Let's give you some extra time. Dude, why chat? Why am I so good at the game, dude? Anduin versus Zeal! I am more than what you bargained for. The light shall bring victory. His hand, though. This. Three days, three days away to chat until solar eclipse. Chat, I've been doing it. I've been watching videos on the, the James Webb telescope. I don't know if you guys pay attention to cosmology, but uh, I'm like pretty excited about some of it. Cause it's like huge meta breaker and like Well, it's like keep on panning. Bruh. Kind of illegal. We don't have very good follow ups here, which is bad. Besides universe accelerating its expansion. Um, so the big thing that I've seen is that, so like if you assume the big bang, like there's a bang that it takes a while for things to happen. And basically they now have seen like, so there's these universes that are like full fledged universes. 
and they really shouldn't exist if that makes sense like it, it's it's because it's like too early uh they didn't have time you know chat it's like it's like turn one and you see like three eight eights on board you're gonna be like what the heck how are the three eight eights on board you know Like basically, they kind of knew, like they would be like something something about the rules of the game have been cheating. So they've they've seen these universes that are absolutely massive, like way in the history of the universe, um, which kind of throws everything off. Which is uh, so so they're doubting the Big Bang, like, but it also is like how you know so. Wait, did they just like? Did they play around Showered Ruin there, there? The Big Bang is a theory, buddy? I mean, I mean, now it is. <laughs> Wait, do I have it? No. Alright. Space ain't real. Chat, the Earth is flat, right? <laughs> Bruh. Son of a dead, dude. I mean, so, so yeah, the Big Bang might be uh, overthrown as a theory, which is kind of crazy, uh, uh, because it's like they like basically everything is up for grabs right now. Uh, it's like a scientific free for all. <laughs> like I don't even know what they're gonna teach kids, like because they might say the Big Bang and then like why is why do they have these giant unit like galaxies? Fun could be so tilting. <laughs> Just gotta stop worrying, dude. But it's super cool, dude. I love like scientific drama when you have like different like scientific fields arguing over like what happened. Do you restart the universe? Well, so there's like lots of theories on what's happening. One theory is just like they messed up. Like there's something happening, like with our instruments. Um, the simplest answer is correct, God. Well, the God, the, uh, the dude, I hate the God answer. Cause like the God answer is like saying, even if you believe in God, you have to, you have to decide, well, how is like, the point of science is to figure out like, what's God doing up there? You know, like, how is he, how is he, you know? Like, what is God, dude, I, dude, I hate the God answer, dude. It pisses me off. It's just like, well, it's like, instead of like figuring out like, okay, what's going on and actually finding this interesting. It's like, you don't have to do any thinking. You just say, oh, it's God. And then you're, you're problem solved. All right. Cause even if you like the OG scientists were, were Christian and they wanted to figure out how God was working. Right. So. Or like like the OG sites are like Christians and Muslims, right? Like a lot of like religious people were really good. Were, were scientists, right? I don't know. He played it safe. Yeah, there are probably a lot of people just faking it so they didn't get like killed by the church, but still. I feel like they're gonna go coin five drop next turn, so. Yeah, dude, I mean, I love all the theories. I mean, like, the theories are kind of like, like just massively speculating, right? You know, we're in a black hole. They're, they're, they're cool though. I like all of them. Like, I think they're really interesting, even though like, it's, it's just massive, like, you know, <laughs> you know, maybe this, you know, but I still think they're like madly fun.
you know, like, like, I mean, even like multiverse theory, it's just like, it's one of those things where I see what they're thinking, but at the same time, it's like, we'll never really be able to know. It's like, it's fun though. It's fun making up theories. Like, I, I really like that stuff, but it's like... <laughs> Marvel came up with the faulty verse? Yeah, it did. I don't really buy, I don't, I don't know what, like, I buy anymore. Dude, like, the universe is so freaking massive that it's, like, it's insane that it is, like, just how, like, massive it is and it's out there. And we're just, like, I don't know, it blows my mind. Well, it's, like, some theories, like, we might, we're not going to be able to test probably for who knows how long, but happening at the same time ever at once and it'll continue to do so far. That's the, that's the, that's the plot of, uh, what's it called? Uh, that book, right? What's, um, uh, Slaughterhouse Five, right? That were like outside of time kind of thing. What do I want to do about these jerkwads? Do I want to play glowstones here? Do I want to take a six mana health? This seems like the strongest play. That toy was made just for me. I don't know. I I I also do, just don't like the like the I I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't think it was this. Yeah, it wasn't disproved, but it's just like cool that like a lot of the theories are just like up for grabs right now on like standard cosmology stuff, which is I just think is interesting. You know, I just like, I just like meta breakers in general, if that makes sense. I wonder. Could rather heal here. Wait, um, now that I know it's not Rat Trap, I probably play, or it's not, like, I think there's a good chance it's Rat Trap, so I think I'm going to play around Rat Trap here. My range is not I'm not throwing away my shot. I'm not throwing away my shot. Bruh. Kind of illegal. Holy illegal chat. <laughs> My blood boils for war. If three right. So what do I do here, dude? I'm getting wrecked. Bro, it's kind of bullshit. 
Wait, if I just draw a time winder, we can wait. Am I just dead, dude? Wait, I'm just dead? Wait, one off lethal. All right, we just have to draw a time winder, chat. Okay. All right, I got to figure out how to do this, but we got to draw a time winder. And then I don't know what we do from there. Um, Double with Astro. Wait. Bruh. Son of a gunshot. I'm so dead. Light sing and the impure fall. Touch you quickly. You have better. But yeah, I don't know, the... I'm trying to find like videos on like James Wed stuff because it's so interesting, but... I don't know. It, it's also just crazy how we can figure out so much from just like little pic pictures in the sky of like, all right, you know, do you watch anime? I, I, I say I, I watch anime more than the average person and less than the average person that ask me if they watch anime. Anduin versus Garrosh. Victory or death. The light shall bring victory. Astonishing. Ooh, chat, notorious beamer Amon, chat. Famous for his beaming ways. Trust me, it's like, uh, yeah, so. Let's warm you up. Ooh, insane top deck, right? Light sings and the impure fall. Just choose. I could just go in here with like, I play one, I play this for one, I play Zillix for two. Um, and that's like a really strong, fast play. I think I actually prefer that to um, holding it out for the OTK here. Just so much tempo. Get rid of their armor. You know what's actually the, probably the play? To put their armor down to one. That's actually a huge mistake by me. Because if I have one, they'd like almost have no way of killing me. My board here. Let's see if I threw. Okay. All right. Man. Your 
Mm, bad. Very bad. I think we got him here. Oh, they gotta go for one mana poison with weapon, and they get double poison with weapon. They probably have me, but see if they hit the good weapon here. They're the good weapon, they probably win. If they don't, I probably win. So I've got a time window ready to go. It's an okay weapon, but it's still probably a win for us. Chad Notorious Beamer, man. Famous for his beaming ways. Said his last BM. I choose death. It's like a sweet NRA. <laughs> hello, hello, sub area. Chad, do you like to do cherry emote? <laughs> they will never catch me. I'll do anything but get a new chair, dude. Dude, I like my chair, dude. I refuse to change.
Is this pre-recorded? Hey chat, I'm having a great time this uh, uh, date in uh, 2024. Uh, you know, it's, it's great, you know, that, you know, some days you like that it's the weekend, but some days you actually like that it's just a, a Monday, but I like both, you know? Sometimes you like it's a Friday, sometimes you like it's a Monday, sometimes you like that it's a Wednesday, you know? <laughs> What does it get? Best speech in the world. Chad, do you think I should like leave on a VOD after this to farm uh farm uh ad money? Cause I, I have to leave in like an hour. So, like I, I can't stay up all night. Do I put on a VOD? Yep. I'm supposed to watch now. I'm the perfect toy for you. Just do in real life stream. These are the things like this is why like advice in the world is so terrible. Because people won't like actually say things, they'll just be like, just just uh, spend your whole life for streaming, bruh. Not worth the tears. One dose solves any problem. It's awkward, it's like so likely to be counterspell. Water! Sweet, beautiful water! It would have been at Counterspell and the other one. <sighs> Putting VODs on is illegal. It's actually legal. It's I, I actually can put on a VOD and lie to you guys and say it's not, not say it's a VOD. Um, hey, and uh, Twitch doesn't recommend that because it breaks trust. But if I want to like slowly gaslight uh, and uh, drive chat, chat insane, that might be this first step, you know? <laughs> that toy was made just for me. <laughs> I'm the perfect toy for you. <laughs> Are you trying to Hearthstone? <laughs> Chad did classic Hearthstone with like like a chill with Yeti on one, you know? Nah, dude, I need the sex cult, dude, sometimes, dude. Like, I need it. I need it. Seriously, though.
It's kind of crazy, like... Use hands while sex holding? Uh, yes. But I, I can do it, I can do it without hands as well. Nice top deck gray worm dude. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Um I think I might as well kill this actually. Reruns killing streams? Wait, what does that mean, Alex? And I yelled, it's panda time. Oh, why are these going face, bro? Like, come on, hit face, dude. Bro, like, literally none have gone face. And I want them to go face because then my lifesteal minions get the hits. But they're just, like, high rolling the shit out of this. Literally everyone is traded, dude. So they didn't get, like, what could have happened is, like, I just get all that back. actually such bullshit I don't know how to win here now uh bro it's brutal dude I don't have any dragons left in my deck um uh, I guess I go for this tap first because I could hit almond the wall or funnel cake here Drifty's kind of good actually if I hit something here Another thrifty, okay. Alright, well. Water, sweet, beautiful water. Water, sweet, beautiful water. I I mean, since Twitch made and before the vibe, the viewer was to visit the site for live action interaction. Yeah, I mean, it's still about that, Alex. Um, I, I, I only do it sparingly. Um, if I do it all the time, it hurts this channel. But, uh... But if I, like... When, the, when, the, when we got a big viewership like this, if I put it on, like, the rerun... <laughs> You know, uh, it's like it helps me helps me pay the bills, so. Fresh fell steel. Out of the kill. Am I dead here? Me. What a vod get from a rerun? Well, the the vod is like different. I'm talking about like oh, this is a live showing. I'm not sure exactly sure how vods work. Um I think I go life steely boy here. I 
I could go double remove, but Life Steely Boy I think is a little bit stronger here. I'm not throwing away my shot. Mm, no wear and tear of any kind. Come on, I want them to tear. Is this really? I want them to have to tank this. Okay, hit the Amethyst, dude. Win for no hands? This looks like a win for no hands, champ. Wait, what? Does they really have 17 damage here? I feel like this deck tracker thing isn't really working. Okay, okay. Um, do I have lethal here? Leroy Copy Boy, right? Is lethal? Um, so this is 6, 14. Yeah, it's lethal, right? I'm just panicking from like Facilito. Two turns ago, dude. Yes. <laughs> Keep repeating yes, this is the best deck in the game. All right, let me get my rerun ready while, while we're queuing. Alright. We can do uh, yesterday's yesterday's VOD. Chat, it's me in the past. We're still queuing by the way, so bam, oh that's great. Wow. Do I remember this? This is a great time in my life, chat. This is, uh, this is, things went really well for me. You know, all that hard and work paid off when we beat the Demon Hunter. Dino T. All right. Back when we were young, dude. True. I pause because I can write it's so over concede and not use the cabin defense and I won't get bad. Dude, righteous Larcidus, not gonna lie. I go back in the VODs and try to find people calling the game over to ban them, but I haven't I, I must have missed you doing it, so I'll catch you next time, dude.
Hey, man. Yeah. Oh, we just got some dragon boys. Right, give me a one med drop. One drop top. Ooh, actually, we're just gonna go, um... Chat witness the skill. Starting the operation. Light sings and the impure fall. Light sings and the impure fall. Everyone stay in sync. Chat, I remember when I was getting comments 80 times a day of like, Mr. Streamer, why don't we run the dream boat? Light sings and the impure fall. Light sings and the impure fall. <laughs> <laughs> you got this is a cute card, right? Oh, it's like gift wrapped, you know? Like, don't you want to just hug this little dragony boy? Like, oh. Free funnel cake? Oh, that's so good, dude. That's so good, dude. Wait, I just got double free funnel cake, chat. Chat, did anyone see what I saw? Okay, okay. Consider I was hoping to hit um time winder there, but I bricked. Time's up. 
Let's do this. I think I over trade here now. I haven't even gotten enough dragons down. It's crazy, dude. Alright, I um I may have messed up that turn, but I think it went over well. Like I just almond threw back here and went easily, right? Did I miss five face, dude? <laughs> really? I could see that. Uh From the worm, uh, that sucks. That could be that could have been lethal this turn, dude. It is finished. You win. Snake in your boot. Hmm. 
Wait, how did the wait how did how did uh how did the it's mocha ass is pinned right now? Wait How did this happen? Uh, it's supposed to be the deck. Pinned by no hands gamer? I feel like this is a lie. Do I have two turn? So if I go time winder here, right? Um, it's 17 plus 13 and then uh, not lethal. Uh, I guess I still go for it though. I don't know, we could chop deck something. The lethal right? I'm a little off here though. Is that lethal? Plus six is not lethal, right? Ah, oh, son of a gun. I wish I just double traded on that. I don't have discounts, like, so I can just Leroy. I don't know. Come <laughs> a boomer with technology added. I see what you're saying. What's the secret to being so sexy? Um, I don't know, dude. Uh, buy runestones. That helps me a lot. <clears throat> Bro, this this wall is brutal. Wait, do I still have it though? I think I still have it. Wait, they... Why did they kill my guy here? Wait, I'm just barely off here actually. Wait, Funnel Cake ends it though. I think. Okay, 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 okay. I go Leroy here, chat, right? 
And then funnel cake get, gets me. Funnel cake. Wait, I don't even. The math is way easier than I'm making it out to be. <laughs> Oh my god, was he Shall bring victory. Wait, Paladin did? Gold Panner is really an inspiring character. Life is tough, but just keep on panning. Crab did. Well, did he mess up there? He did. He could have played this and gotten the rushy boy.
Chad, I think... <laughs> I think uh, I should have higher uh, standards of uh, <laughs> uh, tougher restrictions on chat saying stupid comments. Thoughts? And how will people like me ever to get the comment? I could copy this, but then it doesn't die. So it doesn't actually work because of the plus three plus three. So I think I just own the duel here. Don't really have anything good to shutter walk. Ignis is more value than I need. I think I take Puzzle Master here. This could pull us some serious skin. So I walk as it's in the lead for my Yeah, dude. Did it die into its own death rattle? Oh, it did. You're right, because of the self too. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> My bad. All right, chat. No hands. Am I single? Uh, yes. 
I am currently single. Or am I? Unless you count situationships with chat's mom. <laughs> <laughs> Chad, I'm married to the job, as they say. Hey Chet, I feel like I, I don't go Zimmery here. I don't know why. I must consider. Together in harmony. You've been single for a while now, buddy. <laughs> Dude, have I been? Dude, Chad, I told you I was in a relationship last year, right? But, I, but they were like, it's either Chad or it's me. And I was like, don't make me choose. <laughs> <laughs> and I, uh, I never really chose chat, you know? <laughs> I must move quickly. Let the pain speak to me. Do I have lethal here? Leroy, uh, Leroy, I just, uh, boring play. Time's up, let's do this. <laughs> Anduins versus Illithin. This ends now! The light shall bring victory. Demonios. Demonios. So I've learned you keep this card so you can forge it on two. Um, and then you have an answer for their, their, uh, their big drop. Kind of interesting, right? What's with the higher viewer count? We got some big raids and the stream's just been popping lately. We got a, a big pocket train raid. We got a big funky monkey raid. Yeah. 
kind of illegal. Nice toy just for you, you got there. Would be a shame. So this is so good because often they have to trade into this. So it gets you more than the five heal. It also gets you like, sometimes this will heal you for like 13. I'm the perfect toy for you. I'm the perfect toy for you. Che, who am I? That toy would just be just for me. Man, this is so annoying. I don't have any good way to deal with this jerk wad. Uh, I don't want to go Shattered Ruin for like such a high... Come on, just trade the 2-3. Nice. Okay, now I can justify Shattered Ruin. I'm going to trade the 2-3, dude. Son of a gun, dude. I kind of have to go Shadow Ruin, dude. Like, my other plays just aren't good enough here. Ooh, now I can go up. We'll take the risk. Um, Ignis one mana weapon. Uh, we could get adjacent, which could be really good here. Yes. Um. By the light. Vacancies equalized. That toy was made just for me. I'm the perfect toy for you. Got an awkward. Do I have the ruin on this board? How do I win this game, dude? Need like funnel cakes here. I don't think I have an out here. By the Some sort light. of weapon bullshit.
doing versus Gera. Victory or death. The light shall bring victory. How do they have Vanguard every three? It's two games. Um, so they don't have it against me every single game. But uh, I said this earlier. Uh, remember, Majin, or half of people are unlucky on average. And you sound like you're one of those people. So unfortunately for you, dude, um, you're going to get a lot of bad luck in life. Um, you know, sorry to, sorry to tell you the truth. Uh, because your opponents literally have weapon every three cards. You said it yourself, right? It's only two copies, yet it's happening every single game. Um, so you're unlucky, and you got to figure out how you want to like adapt to your life like that, you know? So. I would recommend like chess. Because then the only way you can get lucky, unlucky, is like you got black, you know, instead of white. But that's just me, dude. Might have messed up. Um, I could have funnel cake and play this down, but I don't really want to. I want to save it for this. So I might have messed up because I, I I used coin to play this, but it's done so much work. So I don't know. It's the confirmation bias. So confirmation bias is a, something a bunch of nerds came up with to pretend to try and gaslight you into thinking that the world isn't against you. All right. I figured this out because uh, I asked a friend and they told me, um, and I was like, yes. Uh, I... <laughs> <laughs> I Just use more. <sighs> Bro, infinite funnel cakes, but like. I have infinite mana next turn. It's kind of nice. Thirty people. It's same on my birthday. Yeah, that's a different mathematical thing. Yeah, twenty. So, because like each additional person is like. It's not like uh, I, 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 I'm actually having a hard time explaining the math, even though it's very clear in my mind. So, like, let's say you have 30 people uh, and, you, and they're all born in January. Well, the odds of you having someone born. Wait one second. I got a tough turn.
I think we look for like Ignis here. Is it double Libra here? It's probably double Libra. I, uh, double gold panner, I feel like it's gonna get wrecked. But this is not what I wanted. Ah, uh, dang shit, I'm probably losing this. I don't have like a good follow up on Reno here. I probably, I could just go Leroy for damage. Um, I'm probably losing to Reno here. Wait, they're running duplicates, so maybe we're fine. Well, I just scammed a win chat. Let's go, dude. By yourself, but like I'm gonna win in fatigue though, so it's like um, I also could just draw a power cord and then it does do it by itself. Like they're going for a very slow value win here. Do I have lethal though? Um, Chad, I can go triple Leroy, right? Uh, so I have eight, right? So I can go another 12. Um, so 18. Um, eighteen twenty plus. I trade this off, so three, eighteen twenty, so twenty three plus five is twenty eight. So not lethal. So I think I still might go Leroy though. Actually, is it better to me to duplicate my plus one plus ones? Kind of like that better. It's more annoying. Wait. Never mind. Son of a gun, chat. Do I have any dragons left in my deck? No. Man. Happen to have Reno ready here to go there. It really sucks. And I would have top decked the power cord. Oh, it's brutal, dude. It's freaking brutal. I don't know. I didn't think with like 14,000 cards left, dude, they would get that that fast. Need some easy to hit in plagues though. I could copy the fizzle for what though, dude? Like, what does it even do for me?
Why did they do that? Well, uh, Blade Storm? I see. All right, Frozik. If I win this game, we will be banned. Dude, I would not have done that with Helia in their deck. Like, that is a, that is a risky play, dude. I love it. I mean, I could go either way right now. It's pretty actually neck and neck here. It's like a terrible GG over call. Cause like they could win this game, I could win this game. Like I don't know how many armor much armors in their deck hand here. Could be all in their deck and then they draw cards and they hit plagues and then we win. Dragons left in my deck, right? Yeah. Uh, where are the freaking plagues, dude? I hear it's significantly helped, yeah. But we couldn't have gotten the hell you down to stop Reno, so that's like the big reason, but because if they get to the, the end of their deck, they're gonna take infinite damage. But <laughs> what do I want here? Oh, draw some plagues, 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 plagues. Son of a not plagues. There's a plague. Let's just draw two, right? Come on, draw another plague, bro. Where are the frickin' plagues, dude? Try to fill up their hand, probably, but... Uh, I can make a bunch of Ignis weapons, so they're trying to play defense here. Mm, yeah. This is bad though. They have another Reno in their hand. I have double Leroy for like a lot of burst here. Guess we're taking Ignis chat. They're handful now. Yeah, I mean, if they have enough to lethal me, I die. But if they're trying to play for defense, like just thinking they'll overdraw all my plagues. Um, but it looks like they have it. Son of a gun. Got away with this one, dude. to win the light shall bring victory
Why so few locks in High Legend? Because it just gets wrecked by Demon Hunter, which is the most common and best deck in the game. So it's hard to play that. Like, basically, you're playing lock. You're looking to be a slight favorite against other decks while losing to yeah. It's basically you can't play anything that loses the Demon Hunter right now. You can only play like, uh, you can play decks that either beat Demon Hunter or Demon Hunter. I mean, you could play Warlock. Uh, I know a guy who played Warlock the other day. Um, so, Special Force, <laughs> the a SWAT team came in um, and had him arrested. You know, he should have known better. <laughs> Is Luke my favorite Star Wars character? Probably, just because it's my name. I don't know, dude. I mean, as a, as an adult, dude, I like a, I like a, I like Wedge did. All right. Dude, Wedge is pretty great. But. Okay, this play is kind of full illegal. This is actually so bad for me. Oh god, how do I deal with this shit? I don't have Shadow of Ruin in my hand. Is there a card I can draw? Going next turn, I guess. I mean, it's Jar Jar, dude. I believe that I believe that dude. Um An interesting play. Light sings and the impure fall. Oh, it almost clears it. Hanging in there, hands gamer, chat. Never give up. Hands gamer. Art of the scam, hands gamer. Dude, I saw the Darth Jar Jar theory, dude. It was pretty sick, dude. I was like obsessed with that. Um, I was obsessed with the Darth Jar Jar theory for like when that came out, and I kept texting my girlfriend about it at the time, and she didn't care at all. <laughs> she was like she was like I don't care dude <laughs> I'm like you don't understand it's a big deal it just makes sense <laughs> what is wrong <laughs> We're the worst character. Yeah, it just makes complete sense, you know?
toy was made just for me. No high rules, please. That's okay. They do heal up for completely, which is frustrating, but we'll be okay. Alright, Amadul ends it next turn. I'm the perfect toy for you. My true potential. Hey, they put this back in my hand, did Am I a Highlander deck already, chat? No, I have Gold Panner, son of a gun. I mean, Chad, this kind of ends it, though. <laughs> no way you could lose. Dude, they should have get Botfist, like, Rush, too. Rush Taunt, and it might be playable. You're getting red carded here, bro? Wait, double red carded here, bro? Wait. Wait, all right, are they not killing this? Are we fine? They're just yelling in the face, bro? I think you could just solve your, all your problems by hitting me in the face? It's not how it works. Well, that ends it. No! <laughs> uh, I love your deck. It's so funny to play it. I'm glad you like this, dude. I, I invented this deck with the power of copy-paste, dude. So what I did... It's actually interesting. I feel like part of, like, a big part of my success as a streamer is actually just being able to, like, research new hip hop and decks that are actually good before other people, like before VS finds a lot of them, you know? Like I just know how to use HS replay better than other people. Like I, I don't know. And <laughs> The light shall bring victory. Mm. Light seeds and the impure fall. That's pretty favorable.
Okay, you're not gonna lie, this hand kind of illegal. Nice needle rack totem you got there. <laughs> shame. Bro, the start is actually like full illegal. Why did you trade the zero two useless needle rock totem at the end of your turn? Gain two armor and draw a card. So when I don't trade, what happens, bro? Son of a gun, dude. <laughs> well, uh, uh, sucks, dude. Hit the one and four, dude. I mean, I'm I'm probably still winning to be honest because I have such a tempo advantage. But it still sucks though. Your time. Don't go away. I don't know about this. <laughs> and coin trial here. Yeah, oh, brawl. It's unfortunate. Should I can just still a high roll uh, RNG uh, the, the dragony boy here. Wait, do you you don't go blind for looking at eclipse? That's the point, right? Because it's blocking the sun. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how like eclipse stuff works. I know people use like special eye protection to like protect it, but you can because there's still a bright halo around the outside. Oh, okay. <laughs> Not found in the time put 
Do I have any big dragons? No, but like, I think we should go all in here because like they're turned before Reno here. So I have like a like a alternative win condition now though. We only have one more duplicate in our deck too. Mm, sanitized. How does next stand up again? Uh, we are unfavored against Demon Hunter, but we haven't been doing that bad. Um, <laughs> never came. No, <laughs> Wait, what? Okay. Um, what do I do now? Uh, I don't have Leroy. I don't have the lethal. Does this give me? I guess I choose two minions here. Wait, is the Libra lethal? Wait, I can't have already done copy though. Libra is uh, 18, uh, not lethal. I feel like I'm very clearly about to get um. Reno here though. Wait, McTheridon such a good follow up <laughs> from like, all right, I go McTheridon like after they do their next turn, right? That's actually insane. Like they're gonna go Reno here, right? Then uh, I go McTheridon, and then uh, I don't know after that, but still. Impressively good, yeah, it's insane. Like, they, they pulled out our Time Warner on a Dirty Rat. Here's my left hand, uh, unable to play games, so I'm pretty depressed about it. Any advice for me? Um, you rigid your left hand. Uh, pretty bad, but it sounds like your right hand's still working. Um, but you find new games, dude. Um, so there are games you can play with one hand. Hearthstone is one of them. Pretty, pretty easily. I play it with no hands. Uh, but uh, but yeah. So, but you're probably uh, you're probably not going to be able to play like the games that are hyper perform, like shooters, stuff like that. You know, that are hyper like uh, control based. We have to do more like mind based games. Um, so. Do I have lethal here? Yeah. So, um, a huge, like, eventually, now a lot of people are lucky it doesn't happen until, like, they're 40, 50, but, uh, a huge amount of people, uh, because I remember when I was in my 20s and I'm talking to people, uh, because I tell them about my health problems, a huge amount of people have health problems in their life and they have to, they lose something. And it's tragic. It's tragic. Often you lose something you love. Um, but often you can find something new you love. Uh, but this is hard, you know, uh, especially when you really love something. Just like... Uh, if you love, you know, you're dating someone and they break up with you, this is hard, but you can always find somebody new, uh, you know, and you might end up loving them even more. So, uh, point is hang in there. All right. I'm just kidding. You, uh... <laughs> Go back there and discover winning the game. Can 
Dude. This is for real though. That's the actual answer to happiness, dude. Alright, Chad, do you go for Ignis 5 mana weapon here? Um, I feel like I want to go Ignis 5 mana weapon here. And then use that to leverage it uh, with this. I feel like 10 mana weapon is too slow at this point. Five mana weapon, if I get four drop, it's insane. Alright, we want adjacent. Uh, do I take draw two? I probably take draw two. The other ones suck. Like, I don't really need armor. Even though it's like value overload, like, um, I think I'm still gonna take it here. But I might not play it next turn. Miracle Salesman is. So, chat. Let's say you go and you eat a burrito every day of your life. Um, now, are burritos really that good? Uh, yes, but there are other things you might like more. Um, but uh, not only is the burrito just good every day, but it's reliable, you know? Now, now burrito isn't like the meal, like you don't, you don't go to your friends and just like talk about like, oh, I had a burrito today, but at the same time, it might be your favorite food. You know, you might talk about like, oh, I had lobster. Lobster might be like the amanthol. Uh, that's like, you know, but, uh, sometimes you just want a burrito. Dude, my hand's hella awkward. Sometimes, or, I don't know. Dude, I, I realized, dude, I, I did the burrito metaphor, but, like, people liked burritos too much. All right, what about, like... <laughs> I didn't realize how much people like like uh, burritos. All right, chat, what about, like... like uh, Chat, what's, like, a food that people... All right. All right, most common foods eaten in America. Uh, we have potatoes, french fries, hamburgers, cheeseburger, grilled cheese, steak bouquet. I must consider... I think I might just go in now. Uh... Water! Sweet, beautiful water! Yeah. Let's give you some extra time. I'm mob! Water! Beautiful water! Is Leroy ever lethal? Libre is not lethal, so I think I might just go for this first, then weapon hit second.
think I'd rather have thrifty drifters um because they're easier to dump even though the double lever is great because I still do I want double lever or do I want a, a double thrifty hmm I'm gonna take double thrifty Nah, I wish I had taken Leroy now, because uh, Leroy is lethal. Well, I just drew him, dude. Leroy Jenkins! Not easy, dude. All right, chat. I gotta get ready for sex cult. I'm gonna put a rerun on chat. Uh, I'm gonna put a rerun from yesterday. Uh, but yeah, uh, thanks everybody. So this is the same deck from yesterday. Here we are. We'll just jump right into the middle of this game. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I'm gonna make myself disappear. Thanks everybody. Uh, let's let's change the settings to rerun. Yeah. I, I should do a, like an exclamation point priest uh, and get the deck list ready. Dude, I still can't spell Zimmer, you did. Zimmer, okay. Hmm. I put rerun on it. And bam, alright. I'll be back in like three, four hours, chat. Uh, maybe we stream more, maybe not. I don't know. Depends how I'm feeling, but uh, but yeah, we're gonna have a nice rerun on. So uh, thanks everyone for hanging out. And uh, feel free to stick for here for the rerun. supposed to share we're doing this because um I don't want them to gain six life here
Quasi Highlander Death Knight with two times weapon. Uh, any good in the meta? Haven't heard of it, dude. To get McDerrit on here. No <laughs> warlock command, I beg of you. Need to draw a time winder and we win, but you could also draw a glowstone. Lots of outs for lethals here now. Bag. And we win. Your time. Do you play meme decks? Um, so I, I usually play decks that have some sort of like, uh, I don't want the meme decks I play to be meme decks. I want to win, but I don't necessarily do the most efficient strategy of winning. I more like, I might play a tier three deck that has a little bit of meme ability, but I always like, I don't, I always have like a play to win element, you know, where I'm not like, you know, or even like, I don't know. Uh, memeing is, I, I don't consider myself full meme. I am like, I like that, like I have a meme like dessert, you know? 